these black garments represent a, a typical feature of an in, undeveloped an, inner anima figure. That would mean that his whole capacity of love is mostly autoerotic. When a man has not developed his anima, his feminine side is very generally very narcissistic. That's what women painfully feel that when a man in love is meowing under her window like a tomcat in love, uh, he really loves his own fantasy. He loves his own being in love. But there's a long way for him to learn to love her and not enjoying his own being in love. And uh, if you read in literature, a young man, when he generally discovers the experience of love, it's mostly a completely autoerotic uh, uh, fantasy out of which he has, through a painful development, learned to love the woman not as the object of his romantic fantasies, but as a human, human partner. What does this inner transformation mean in terms of the man's relationship to an actual woman in outer life? The peeling of the black anima and their transformation in a white golden anima is the transformation of the loving capacities of a man, of a, a transformation of his eros from a primitive autoerotic fantasy into a true human capacity for love. As soon as this transformation takes place, he then is attacked by primitives who want to keep the, the woman, that she should remain black and stay with the blacks in a black village. So there is a, a strong primitive tendency to relapse again into the old attitude, but the dreamer can successfully fight it off.